folks, we get a lot of questions on the pruning of your rosemary, of your lavender, more so on the lavender, but uh, they go hand in hand, so I'm gonna use both of them to show you. This is a nice little lavender plant, so when you purchase it, it is ideal to prune each of those stems. Reason being is each stem, when you prune it, has little side shoots that are ready to take over. So once you prune that, they'll split off and then grow too. Once they start regrowing, you'll prune those, and again, they'll split off and branch and form two. So if you catch the plant early, when you first purchase it, put it in the ground, go ahead and prune it, each one of those stems, it won't take too long, and then wait for it to regrow, so about four to six weeks, and start to take off in the ground or container, wherever you've put it. Then go ahead and prune those again, another four to six weeks, go ahead and prune those only ever do really the top third of the green foliage. So when it's young like this, all of the foliage is green. So that whole stem length, and you'll go ahead and cut the top third. Over the years, however, once that canopy forms, the sunlight really won't be reaching down into the center of the plant, and it will become woody, so to speak. That's nothing wrong. That's actually kind of what you're after, knowing that the top canopy kind of thing tightens and those leaves are all still there. But when that happens, the top third of the green foliage, you don't take into account wherever it's that woody defoliated part. So when it's young, obviously cutting the top third, you're cutting quite a bit. As it gets older and that defoliated section of that plant, you wouldn't count that stem length. You'd go to where the green is up the top and you would take the top third of that green. So on that side, you know, over the years, you're really not pruning a whole lot second, third, fourth year and onwards. You're really just kind of keeping that shape to the plant and tidying it back up. Um, unfortunately, it kind of looks small, so the tendency is not to prune. But the reason that you prune early is to get the branching and bushing low. When the plant is full grown, it's working from a, a large network of uh, branching and bushing. It's really a low center of gravity. So it's nice and low to the ground. It's not growing and then branching, causing it to be top heavy, lay open with snow and sleet and rain and that kind of thing. So catch it early. It'll give you better longevity in the years to come. It will reward you with longer growth on that side. Obviously you're using all of it, you know, as you're pruning as well, because that's where the tasty tender foliage is. But uh, can't stress enough on the, on the health of the plant and the look of it too, to be well kept. Pruning early really does help you out, so. If you have any other questions, hope to see you out at the farm.